Hi, this is Gina B. Living Foley, and welcome to my channel. And I sure hope that if somebody finds this, that they get inspiration to go to your local Dollar Tree. Pardon my lighting, I don't have a regular camera, I'm just working with my cell phone. But um, I'm living just beyond the Sacramento area, I'm kind of in between Tahoe and Sacramento. And we only have a couple of Dollar Trees here and they're really not fully stocked. So I went in today because of the holiday weekend coming up into a Folsom Dollar Tree, Folsom, California. And I cannot believe what I found. So if you can bear with me with my lighting, my low lighting, I don't know if anybody else in, in the California area is dealing with this, but my phone has been down... It's been in and out all day, definitely no internet service and no um, uh, Xfinity has completely shut down, so I'm very limited. But if you're here, welcome, and I sure hope I can inspire you to run to your Dollar Tree before the weekend is up and everything is gobbled up. But I'm going to go ahead and get started with this. Um, my channel is very small. I, I don't have a lot of followers. It's more of a personal channel, but every once in a while I'll put up a Dollar Tree haul. It'll last a year and then I'll take it down. But this one is epic. I am really looking forward to sharing with you some of these items. I'm going to go ahead and start out with some skincare products and essential oil blends that I found that I was really blown away about because... Even if you go on the internet and you try to buy discount essential oils, they tend to be very expensive. Well, here is what I found from um, the Dollar Tree, Dollar Twenty Five Tree. <laughs> um, hold on, I'm just gonna back up for a minute. I'll be out of focus, but when I come back, you will see what I've got. Uh, so. The Aroma Guru has been around the Dollar Tree for a little while, and usually they're those little rollers or it's a little dispenser, um, and it was limited to tea tree oil and um, I think peppermint and lavender. Today I found the um, eucalyptus, which I have never seen before. If any of you out there are able to regularly to find that, God bless, because literally I have never seen that before. So there's that one. And then I got a breathe blend. Now, a breathe blend means that it has been infused with several different essential oils, and then they add like a carrier oil like jojoba, in their case, they added jojoba and coconut oil, but it is um, a nice long list of essential oils. Um, definitely, we know we have um, eucalyptus. I believe there is um, peppermint, basil, and a few others. If I could find my glasses here, let me give you the whole list. It is pretty amazing. Um, Eucalyptus, peppermint, basil, as I said, they added some tea tree and rosemary. And you can put this in a diffuser, even though it's been a little bit, you know, I call it watered down. It's been put in a, um, a uh, coconut and jojoba oil base, which is, you know, very healthy. It's a very clean product. If you go online, the Aroma Guru, they're, they're more expensive than $1.25. So that is a beautiful blend. I would use it for sleep or allergies or headaches. If you're really, really nasal sensitive, though, and you get migraines, I wouldn't recommend it for that. I'm referring to a tension headache. And then it's turned around, but this one is the peppermint. Um, straight peppermint, which I've seen before, but it's always been a roller, kind of difficult um, to, to roll it out. Um, these are a regular bottle, which is fantastic. And you can just put a few drops in and there you go. I was very impressed with that. And then I also got an age-defying 
um, serum with added heliochrysium. So heliochrysium is an essential oil that comes from a plant that's really used, to be honest with you, for pain. Um, but it has other properties and it's very good for the skin. So they added some of the heliochrysium into it. Um, it has a fractionated coconut oil, jojoba oil, very nurturing to the skin. Um, rose hip oil, which is amazing for the skin. It has essential oil of rose, helichrysium, and ylang ylang, another skin fortifying essential oil. Um, and sandalwood. All very, very good, but it's an age-defying serum. And if you're not used to um, a serum that's oil-based, you need to be prepared for that. You may put it on, it's going to feel really greasy, it's going to make your skin look really, you know, glassy. Um, and you may not really appreciate that. But as a 30-year veteran in the, you know, massage field... Um, I can tell you that a serum that is essential oil based like this is actually very nurturing to the skin. Um, if you don't want to put it on your face, it's just, it's fantastic for your hands and dry elbows. You don't have to necessarily put it on your skin, but I'm going to give it a try. And it's also very good for the decollete area. You can use it underneath your regular skin regimen. So like if you have a night cream, you can use it underneath that. So those right there to me were worth going. I couldn't believe it. And then I found another beauty product. I mean, this is just to pull your hair back when you're doing your skincare routine. This is very soft velvet, scrunchy, and I thought it was such a beautiful color. So I got that. Then in the beauty department, I found the um, knockoff. It's brand new and improved by EAD. I don't even know how to say that. You can see that there. But it is the Armani Code by Giorgio Armani. They call it Floral Code. It's a knockoff. It smells amazing. I took it out, and it is just heavenly. I have been to the counter and smelled the real deal and it is really, really frightening how close it is. Um, I don't really use any alcohol-based perfumes typically, but if you spray this a little bit and let it dissipate and just kind of wave your hand through it, it will last on, you know, I just don't do it directly on my skin, but it's wonderful. A room spray, um, I'll use it on my clothes a little bit and then just air them outside. And I mean, the perfume really is very close to the real thing. So another amazing skin, not skin, but, um, beauty product back to skin. Speaking of, of that, uh, we have a, Hyaluronic Acid Serum, which we all know those can be very expensive. And um, it's either CBI or OBI skincare. It is 1.2 fluid ounces. And uh, you just use it twice daily, three to four drops on the face and the decollete neck area. I would recommend this and a couple of drops of the age defying serum. And I have a feeling that's going to be a nice combination, a really nice combination. So I would definitely go to your local Dollar Tree and see if you can find these products. I also found a hyaluronic acid skin cream, and that is the Global Beauty Care, which is quite common to find at the Dollar Tree. It is 1.7 fluid ounces, and beautiful packaging, 
really beautiful packaging. You can see that there. And I'm just really impressed. Okay, I want to get really honest about, you know, BB creams, typically very expensive. And honestly, I, I usually go to like my local beauty supply or, you know, one of the, you know, like a Clinique counter or something to get something like this, or even maybe even a health food store where it's well above $35. But I, I have used this in the past and the, the, um, packaging is different. Um, it's by new color and um i have used it in the past and it's it's quite good it's perfect to put in my purse so if you have an emergency need to reapply it's perfect for that it's not something i would use every day but i mean it's a bb cream so when i looked at the ingredients it wasn't much different than the really pricey stuff let me go ahead and show you one more or two more things that I would consider in the beauty bath department. Um, this was in the um, section where uh, it, it's very close to like all the baby products and then all of the bath products. Um, this is called a PVC soap saver. These are fantastic. And I just bought some really nice, um, what do you call them, beauty bars where you, where you actually can shampoo. It's a shampoo bar. And I'm going to put this in the shower. Um, these at Walmart were much more expensive than $1.25, I can tell you that. And it's just the home collection, regular brand, Dollar Tree brand. Uh, I found something totally new. Uh, it is an infused pressed face powder. I would consider it a setting powder. Powder, excuse me. But it comes in a lovely little package and it provides a smooth matte finish and it sets your makeup and controls the shine. It is green tea infused. It's really a cute little package. It reminds me a little bit of the e.l.f. brand, the way that it's packaged. You can see and it's a, a white powder just like you would see with e.l.f. It's a setting powder and it does smell very clean like a green tea it's very subtle but it's there and um highly impressed with that i'm going to give that a try and that's all the beauty products let me go ahead and show you some art supplies i got some beautiful acrylic paint brushes watercolor paint brushes i also use these when we're defining areas when you touch up places in your home and packages of this are they get really expensive so i scored those for a dollar 25 can't believe it the premium acrylic is an excellent product i have literally just painted some sunflowers on my porch and um, i was mixing colors with um uh you know, decoupage to kind of create, you know, a glossy appearance on my porch. It turned out fabulous. And then I've got to go over it with um, epoxy. But I actually used this brand and I have bought more. They have lots of colors. I was really impressed with that. Couldn't believe that. Um, so the the whole craft area, um, for you Dollar Tree enthusiasts, you, you all know, Crafters Square, it is amazing. They have the Puzzle Saver stuff, which I have seen other people haul. And um, this packaging is pretty big. It's four fluid ounces. And um, <laughs> I kind of like it. It's as good as Mod Podge. Very good. It gives a nice little glossy laminate feel. And then if you really want strength, then I top it off with a with a pure acrylic um, clear or even spray paint with a epoxy. So great, great product. Let me get into um, another household item. Uh, I thought these were incredibly beautiful. These were near the Crafter Square area. 
on the next aisle in the home goods department. Uh, it is a hook. They call it a, a, a hook crochet, which is obviously a different language, but, um, it's just an antique white hook and it comes with the hardware that you can apply to a wall, um, the back of your closet door and they're metal. Very good quality product. Very nice quality product. I didn't pick it up, but they had some amazing um, self-stick, you know, where you like pull something off and you stick it on kind of like um, contact paper, but they were in the print of like wood and um, the, you know, shiplap tile. I mean, they had so many different beautiful patterns but I don't have any use for that at this point. But if anybody's looking right now, they have a plethora of that type of stuff, stuff that you can, you know, do a backsplash with. I was blown away. Stuff that I have found at Home Depot for much, much more. Uh, once you go into more kitchen, I found the Betty Crocker brand, name brand. Uh, you get one, two, three, and you get two of the bigger one. But at Walmart, these are more than $1.25. I'm just saying, you, I mean, all day long, you can, it's amazing, the savings. Savings is amazing. Okay, I'm backtracking back into the beauty supply. I did find these adorable little nail files. Um, as a massage therapist, I have to have nail files. Got to keep your nails clean and filed down. And those can get expensive. Um, I opened this, but this was so pretty. I'm wearing it right now. This is called Hershey's Milk Chocolate Flavored Lip Gloss. I didn't taste any flavor, but it looked really pretty. And there's no lipstick underneath. I would say wear a brown lipstick and then put this on top. It is very solid the way it stays on your lips, but it feels very nourishing. It doesn't feel waxy at all. It doesn't have that uncomfortable, like, you know what I'm talking about, that gummy feeling. It's very clean product. So that is a nice little product right there. It's not a lot, but it was just so cute. I was so enthusiastic I had to open up the package and give it a try. It's got a little bit of sparkles in it, but again, it's the Hershey's Milk Chocolate Flavored Lip Gloss. It was actually in the gift section. You know that section you can find and it's like for quick gifts? It was, it was in that section. Okay, final things in kind of like, you know, hearth and home and, you know, bath supplies. I did make it to the medicine aisle and I did get some more masks. Um, we still mask up from time to time um, here in, in our area and so I always keep those in the car. I have such a tiny face that I use the kids ones and people giggle and just think they're wonderful. I get a kick out of those. You get, these are by Protech U. You get two of the face masks for $1.25. Not, not a fantastic deal, but because of how cute they are and the attention that I get when I wear them, I just have to have them. And they, um, uh, they are ultra soft and they're easy to breathe. They're uh, thermoformed with three layers of protection. They're definitely disposable, and they're the nose bridge with the ear loops. And again, they're kid size, but I mean, for my teeny tiny face, they're perfect. Um, these are the equivalent to the um, Hall's Defense, and I love sucking on these. They're filled with vitamin C, and they're kind of 
for me. I, I don't do a lot of sugar, but these give me a little bit of a sugar lift if I'm, if I'm working hard. Like, it's great when a, a person's working or doing hard labor. So for me, if I do a lot of massage, I you feel it and you can get a sugar drop. These are wonderful for that. And I don't exceed more than three or four a day, but these really help with a huge glass of water. And you get your daily vitamin C and it has, um, uh, let me see what else it has in there. It, yeah, it's just strictly vitamin C drop. And it, it's got sugar in it. It's got 135 milligrams of vitamin C. And it's only got 4 grams of sugar, which is great. I mean, you can't beat that. That's like my equivalent to a little sugar lift of candy. Um, speaking of which, let's get into some food. Um, these are fantastic. The Munch Rites. Uh, Apple cinnamon flavored baked puffs. These are really, really, uh, you know, very figure friendly. They're 140 calories per serving, which would be, an, you know, I think, an ounce. But you can snack on these. They're fantastic tasting. They remind me of a little bit of a cinnamon donut <laughs> kind of, you know, or if you have ever had like um, a churro. They have that kind of a feel to it. Um, and, you know, um, honestly, with the low amount of sugar, three grams of sugar per serving, that's great for someone like me. So I love that. They had the same brand. By the way, these brands are at regular stores, and they're a lot more. They're in the... In my area, they can get into the $5 range, but Munch Rights is something that you can find at your regular grocery store, Walmart, and health food stores. Um, this is the cheddar and sour cream flavor. Everything's baked. I mean, it's very low in saturated fat. I mean, it, it's, it's just a great snack. Better than a potato chip. And, of course, I got two of the apple cinnamon ones. And then I got, uh, this is by Sunkist brand. This is a, a brand name. Uh, these are breakfast cranberry orange biscuits. They have eight grams of whole grains. They're only 100 calories. Um, they are not gluten-free. I tend to try to stick to gluten-free, but, I mean, I'm not perfect. I'm not going to do that every single moment of the day. But, um you know, they really weren't anything. Um, when I get those protein bar, there's sometimes they're just filled with sugar um, and I won't eat them. These only have four grams of sugar. Um, there's only 15 grams of carbohydrates and the sodium is 40 milligrams. You get five packs of two. So you get two to a pack. These are wonderful if you work and you're on the go and you need to hydrate and re-boost your energy field. Um, these are fantastic for that. So Sunkiss Breakfast Biscuits. $1.25. Can't beat it. Um, and then they had them in a coconut flavor. And so I'm going to give these a try. These are a perfect thing to take on the go when you're traveling or you're working in an environment where your sugar can drop and you just forget about what you're doing. These are just fantastic and they're small, easy to transport. Definitely not a full meal replacement, but, but to me, they're perfect on the go. If you're in a rush with a little cup of tea, you can't beat it. And then I found unsweetened applesauce. It is not the um, Mott's brand. It's not a name brand. It's called Apple Snacks, all natural, no added sugar, and gluten-free, unsweetened applesauce. Another perfect thing to take to work. Put in your kids' lunch pails. And again, I'm sorry for my lighting, but like I said, 
I'm working with a little cell phone. And that is my entire haul. I was so proud of it. I was so excited. So check your local stores for any of these items. And, you know, if you decide to um, follow this little channel, I do put up um, some fun things from time to time that I do. And um, if I find that people want more, please let me know. Hit that subscribe button and follow me and I will do more. You know, it's a lot of fun. Dollar Tree offers people that are on a budget things that normally we would just go, you know what, I'll just pass on that. It's just an amazing place. So that is why from time to time I like to share my finds. So I hope you have a lovely holiday weekend and um, I'll put up another one soon.